today we will discuss about trim boundaries how to do trim boundaries we we are doing trim boundaries in machining part some of the portions may not be important or particular portion is important for machining so to select that particular area or to avoid particular area we go to do trim boundaries in this case i am we are having six packets and i will explain each and every packet in different trim boundaries method go to sketch command okay line commands with point option I am using different options we go to finish sketch if you are selecting this area there is no curves available either two methods you can create curves one method is you have to create curve by using sketch commands that another command is you have to extract the curves from geometry i am going to take second methods menu insert derive curves and i am giving extract legacy let's curve then i will extract this curve here also i will select now i will select this curve the again this portions is also visible so i can't close my curve in this case you go to go for trimming curve curves go to trim curve this portion is required so you go to select this and this is my curve and which one is want you want to keep this curve you go to keep then apply here also you have to use the same command if you want to keep this curve you have to keep now this portion has been selected now we will do this machining like this way here the up of the portion is required here already curve is there you have to trim this you want to keep it this curve apply here also you want to keep this curve you got to keep apply now second curve is completed third one this click which curve you want to keep it i want to keep this curve apply here also you can want to do this type of curves or want to this type of curves
we can make it here this curve is important or you can also make some lines and you can make it also some curves this we want to keep this curve apply here also We want to keep this curve play. Now this portion has been committed. Now we will we will do this any machining here. You can also create some lines. If you want to go for this one, means now we want this particular curve, this portion is to be missing or not to be missing. We have to close that one. We can again go for trim curves. This portion we have to select it, this curve. asking this curve you want to keep it yes apply now here also this curve go to trim option curve you want to keep this curve apply now again here is there it is selected all we will select this one, <coughs> go to this, show the part, this curve is not repair, discard. So now this portion has been selected. Now here also, this curve, and go to this one. And which one you want to keep it? I want to keep it this surface. Keep it. Apply. You see? Now I have selected any methods. For this curve, this portion may be missing or trimmed. Here this portion may be trimmed. Here this portion may be trimmed. Here separate portions. Here this particular portions. Here particular portions. Now after completing this one, we will go for applications, go to manufacturing, go to MCS mill, we have to select that MCS mill, here you can select this portion, save clearance distance means 10 mm, the tool will come 10 mm above the workpiece. Next one is workpiece. We got to specify this is workpiece already specified. Blank. You can go for any one options. I am using bounding block. Okay. Now I am going to use any material by using library. There are number of materials. In this case, I am going to take. 1116 carbon steel it has 152 200 corners and pre machining properties i can say it mild steel ms now we have completed mcs machine coordinate system mill and work now we will go for operations go to kvt milling machines Make it program, make it workpiece method, missing method. Now we are, we have to specify cut area. I am selecting this cut area. Now this time I will not use specific dream boundaries. First I will explain, then I will show it. 
new tool i have taken new tool maybe 5 mm the tool length is 50 mm the cutting edge may be 30 mm cutter this is high speed steel then mill tool number 1 Now cut pattern is follow part or follow periphery or zigzag. I am using follow part and tool flat. I already explained that 50 percentage means how much distance it will move after completion of one cut. If I am taking 5 means 2.5 mm it will move. This is depth of cut. I am going to give 0.5 mm length and cutting parameters. Here we can check it, there is no stop for future machining operations and non cutting moves. Here, how to engage the tool either you can go for helical or go to ram and also plunging. Normally, we will do helical or ram and sail. After completion of machining, the tool will retract back. 10 mm because already we defined self clearance in missing MCS 10 mm should go. Now feeds and feeds are very important. Here we are using workpiece carbon steel means metal steel and my tool material is speed steel so we can go for 30 meter per minute then calculate Feeds and feeds, the sub cutter should rotate 1910 RPM revolution per minute. That feed may be 250 mm per minute. We go to optimize. Now we have completed all those things. Now we go to generate. This is the normal way people will do by using cavity millings. Now it is it gets completed. Without telling anything, we will see the machining process has been completed. But our purpose is how to use or how to specify trim. First, we will see this one, it is taking all materials by using level base we will make it a little bit faster so normally we are doing like this cavity milling we are not selected any special things now we will select how to specific dream go and edit dream this part blank cut area all are same here we can change the tool for smaller tool take it one mm for sewing purpose this may be 15 mm length and might be having 10 mm cutting edge and tool number one this is access tool again we are taking Then we can go for 0.2 mm. Then I have not changed anything cutting parameters, cutting non cutting moves, feeds and feeds. Now we will go for specific trim boundaries. How to do? 